Hello everyone, hope everyone's doing well. Here's the update on the two blue zebra angel fish. Uh, I went ahead and placed them in a 15 gallon tank in the hopes that they would breed. And they did, about a week later, they did go ahead and breed on that Anubius uh, plant there. As you can see, the uh, big uh, bottom leaf there, it's got that huge white glare on it. That's all uh, angelfish eggs. So they are trying to take care of them, but I didn't really want to take a chance. So I went ahead and cut that leaf off and placed it in a five gallon uh, tank here for grow out. And what I did is uh, just place that leaf on a plastic clip next to an air stone uh, to keep the uh, water circulation to help minimize uh, bacteria growth on the eggs. Uh, plus I uh, added a drop of methane blue too, which is supposed to help uh, minimize the amount of uh, bacteria growth on the eggs. I also added a heater in there to keep the temperature right around uh, 79, 80 degrees and it took approximately four to five days for them to, for the eggs to go into the uh, wiggler stage as you can kind of see there um, you can kind of see a lot of little wiggling there hence the wiggling stage but uh, they were in this stage uh, for about another six days or so and then uh, as you'll see coming up here a lot of those wigglers started going into the uh, free swimming stage so once they started hitting that stage, I ended up with quite a few uh, angelfish fry there. You can see quite a bit. So what I'm doing is just feed them with uh, microworms twice a day uh, to keep their diet uh, hopefully uh, up to par. Then I also added a uh, sponge filter there that was already seeded to help try to keep uh, the water uh, clear. So that's all I really have for now, and I'll keep you posted on these guys. Just thank you for watching another video.